Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. Thank you so much for clicking on today's video. Like I mentioned last month, I've decided to do my favorites monthly just so that it's not an hour long video because it's always an hour long video when I do it on a quarterly basis. So I've decided to go ahead and go back to doing these videos monthly. That way I can kind of share my new favorites with you that are fresh in my mind and things that I've been using a lot the previous month. So all of these favorites I used the entire month of June and maybe before and will continue to use because I'm obsessed. So I'm gonna show you my food favorites, my WW food favorites. I'm going to show you beauty favorites, and I also have a few home favorites as well. And then at the very end, I have a couple of new YouTube channels that I've been loving, so I wanna share those with you guys as well. So without further ado, let's jump into June's favorite. <music> chips because who doesn't love chips since I transitioned over to the clean approach to WW I had to really search high and low for a chip that had good ingredients that was cooked in good oils that didn't use natural flavors or maltodextrin and I found them and they have become an absolute staple in my house not only for me but for my husband and that is these Siete chips now they come in a ton of different flavors i love the lime they have a non-dairy vegan nacho that is delicious and this ranch is to die for they're four to five smart points per serving they have perfection when it comes to ingredients i mean literal ingredient perfection you can't go wrong they're the same points as most other chips but they're just so much better for you. So I highly recommend Siete. I buy mine off of the Thrive Market because they're a dollar or so a bag less than I can find at any local store. The link for Thrive is down in the description box. And also there's a link for $20 of free groceries of your choice when you join Thrive Market. So check it out. That's where I get Siete. You guys know I use their queso as well because I absolutely love their queso. It's a great dupe for Tostitos with much, much better ingredients. I've used their tortillas. I pretty much love everything that Siete puts out. Next, I'm gonna share a couple of cold items, mainly so I can get these back into the refrigerator. The first item are my Cleo bars. You guys know I've talked about these over and over again. I absolutely am in love with these. They have great ingredients. Now, are the ingredients perfect? No, but for a sweet treat, you're actually getting a good dose of protein in a sweet treat. They're really, really good. In my opinion, it tastes like a chocolate covered cheesecake. My favorite flavor is the vanilla. I also really like the strawberry. You can pick these up at Walmart in the yogurt section for $1 per Clio bar, which I don't think is too bad for a sweet treat. You can also order these off of the Clio website. I think they are a bit more though than if you just pick these up at your local Walmart. These are six smart points on WW, but only 140 calories. 140 calories or six points of absolute deliciousness. Next up is my hummus the love of my life, my very favorite hummus, and that is the Hope Hummus. This is a clean hummus. All of the ingredients are clean. It is the only hummus that I've been able to find that's not only organic, but also uses olive oil or avocado oil as their oil base. Most of them use kind of crummy oils like soybean oil or canola oil. So I just read ingredients of all the hummuses in the world and found Hope hummus. This kale pesto is my very favorite, but I also really like the original. I've had the, I think black garlic it's called. Every single one is absolute perfection. They have great smart points. You can actually have three tablespoons for two smart points, where normal hummus is two tablespoons for two points. So you can't go wrong, not only with the taste, the points and the ingredients, Hope Hummus is, in my opinion, best in class. Now the next item is new to me and has kind of become my obsession. I have said on my channel that I am not a spicy foods person because honestly, I'm not. But I have discovered a love for buffalo sauce. I looked on the shelves at my local grocery stores. I couldn't find a buffalo sauce that had good ingredients. They all have really, honestly, pretty terrible ingredients until Noble Maid came into my life. Actually, one of my amazing subscribers told me about this buffalo sauce, told me I had to check it out. I was able to order this off of the Thrive Market. They have mild, medium, which is what I have here, and a hot buffalo sauce. These are so good, and the ingredients in these 
are absolutely perfect. So if you want a really good buffalo sauce for wings, meatballs, whatever you like to have buffalo sauce on, I put this on my chicken the other night. This is the best in class when it comes to buffalo sauce. Nice clean ingredients, affordable on the Thrive Market, and seriously, delicious. Now the medium's a bit hot for me, so I think next time my wimpy self will probably get the mild, but Noble Maid hit the nail on the head with this buffalo sauce. Now you guys know that I put the Vital Proteins collagen in my coffee every single morning. It's unflavored, it gives me some protein, gives me the collagen to help with nails, hair growth, it helps with joint recovery after working out. I've been obsessed with that for a long time. I do pick that up at Costco, but I also have it linked in my Amazon store if you don't have a Costco near you. But I have found another collagen that I love using as a base for a smoothie or a protein shake. And that is the Primal Kitchen Collagen Fuel. This is the peanut butter. They have so many flavors of this collagen fuel. It is so good. It has perfect ingredients. As you know, Primal Kitchen makes really, really good, clean food, and this is no exception. The peanut butter is so good. I pair it with my favorite protein, which I'll show you guys next, and I make like a Reese's peanut butter protein shake. It gives me a dose of collagen, but it also gives me 11 grams of protein. So it's a good protein boost and a great way to throw in some extra collagen throughout your day because it tastes delicious. And again, the ingredients are so good. You can have one scoop of this protein for two smart points. So what I do is I throw this in with some almond milk, a frozen banana, and my favorite chocolate protein powder. And basically I make a Reese's peanut butter shake, protein shake, collagen shake, and it's to die for. Next is my favorite protein powder. That is Live Well. You guys know I've been using this for quite a while. I absolutely love this protein powder. It is plant-based, but it is not chalky. Most plant-based proteins I don't like. I find them to be very chalky. They have a weird texture and consistency when blended. This one does not. There's no chalkiness. The flavor is amazing. It has 17 grams of complete protein. So complete protein, similar to what's in quinoa. The best protein you can put into your body is in Live Well. They have three flavors. They have the cacao, which is their chocolate version. They have vanilla, which is always a great option because you can add things to this to make it different flavors. And they also have coconut, which I have come to love. You guys, this has little flakes of coconut in it. It is so delicious. So this is the protein powder that I lean towards whenever I'm making a protein shake. You guys know I mentioned that I really like the chocolate with that Primal Kitchen Collagen, a banana, some milk, and it makes like a peanut butter Reese's shake so good. What's best about these is it is less than 100 or a little over 100 depending on the flavor, calories per scoop, 17 grams of protein, completely clean. This is the cleanest protein I've been able to find, and I thought there's no way it's going to be clean and delicious, and it is. Live Well knocks it out of the park. It is only one smart point per scoop. So it is, again, one of the lowest point value protein powders with the best ingredients, 17 grams of protein, you guys can't go wrong. I'll link Live Well down below and the 10% discount that they gave me to share with you guys. Love Live Well. Highly, highly recommend. I would grab all three flavors. They even include an unflavored one. If you're looking to use an unflavored protein in either a protein shake or in cooking or baking, they also carry that as well. So speaking of peanut butter deliciousness, this is another thing I've recently found, and this is the Lakanto powdered peanut butter. I think my good friend Robin, who's a subscriber here on my channel, brought this up in a Zoom call. You guys, this is so good. This Lakanto powdered protein has perfect ingredients. It's very, very good. It is a great dupe for PB2 or PB Fit if you're not fans of those. All that's in here is the roasted peanut salt and some monk fruit, which is a great sweetener alternative. It's so good. I've been using this in oatmeal, quinoa bowls, for baking, for protein shakes. I love this. I actually found this on the Lakanto website. So I'll link that website down below for you guys. I'm sure you could find this at your local grocery store. I just happened to order it off of the website because I wanted to try it and I'm so happy that I ordered this because it's incredible. I also am loving a new little snack that I found, and that are these gluten-free bites. So they're gluten-free, obviously. This is the peanut butter and jelly. I'll put the points here on the screen for one and for two. A serving size is two of these little balls, but sometimes I just have one. They're nutty, they're peanut buttery, they've got the sweetness of the jelly, they have great ingredients, and they keep you nice and full. So they're a great snack to leave in your car, leave in your your desk at work. They're just a really, really clean 
awesome snack. Now there are a couple of ingredients that I don't love, but overall this is a pretty clean option. And again, they keep you nice and full. A little bit of these goes a long way. And last but certainly not least is something I've talked about a ton on my channel and that's Mary's Gone Crackers. Now you guys know I love their seed crackers. I, the, everything is my all time favorite, but I recently found these thins and these are so so good. They remind me of somewhat like a wheat thin. They're a little bit bigger. They're a little bit denser, heartier cracker. I love to put cheese on these, to dip these in hummus. These are super, super good. And they still have the perfection of ingredients that Mary's Gone Crackers always, always has. They are seriously so incredibly good. I'll put the points here on the screen for a serving. You can't go wrong. I love these. And again, this is another item that I buy off of the Thrive Market. All right, it's time for my beauty favorites and I have a few to share with you. The first one is this cute little headband that I am currently wearing or these headbands. You guys, this whole pack, of headbands. Look at all of these beautiful colors, textures. I bought these off of Amazon for literally less than $16. I believe that there are 10 headbands. Yes, 10 headbands for $15.99. That's a little bit over a dollar a headband. These are fantastic quality. I love all the colors and textures. I mean, there's velvet, there's kind of this silky material, there's the leopard print. The blue one that I'm wearing today is the silky material. You guys, these are such a great find on Amazon. I will link them down below for you guys. I love them. They're really cute if you throw your hair up to kind of hold those little wispy hairs back. And it just gives that updo look, a more professional, a more put together look. I love these. I even use them to put my makeup on. They're seriously amazing. I bought one at TJ Maxx. You guys saw that in my TJ Maxx haul. I became obsessed with it and immediately hopped on Amazon and found these and literally you guys game changer. If you're looking for these cute headbands that are kind of all the rage, this is a great price on Amazon. Next is hair care. Now you guys know I color treat my hair. When I started this channel, I had purple hair. Prior to that, I had red hair. Now I'm back to the blonde highlights. So my hair has been through a lot. A lot of damage has been done to this hair of mine. And when we're buying shampoos and things at the salon or even in the grocery store, they're not custom made for us. They're just the color treated shampoo, the dry hair shampoo, the greasy hair shampoo. They're not really custom made for us. So I found a company called Mix Easy. And you can actually go onto their website and create your own custom shampoo and conditioner to match your hair type. It's absolutely incredible. And I've been using this shampoo and conditioner now for a few weeks. I can't believe the difference in my hair. The fact that I was able to put in the ingredients into both the shampoo and the conditioner for my specific hair type has made all the world of difference. I have a hair appointment on July 19th and I'm just curious if my hair lady is going to make a comment about how good my hair looks with these two products. They're absolutely affordable for a customized shampoo. It's very incredibly easy to order these, to choose the ingredients that you want in them. They ship rather quickly. It's a good size bottle. This is a go-to for me. This will be the shampoo and conditioner that I purchase moving forward. I cannot believe the difference in my hair, in the texture, how soft it is, how shiny it is and it's mixed easy. So I will link this down below for you guys as well as a discount code. Head over to them and check them out. It's great to be able to customize shampoo to really kind of fit your type of hair. I literally, you guys, I don't see myself purchasing any other shampoo. Next is a fun little find from Trader Joe's and that is this watermelon facial mist. I showed this in a grocery haul a couple of weeks ago. I've been using it ever since. This stuff is incredible. Whenever you feel like your skin is maybe looking a little bit dry, feeling a little bit dry, or you just want a little burst of refreshness, this is perfection. All you do literally is I give it a quick shake because it does kind of settle to the bottom. Close your eyes, give your face a quick mist, and it just rehydrates your face, resets your makeup for the day, this stuff is fantastic. And I want to say it was $5 at Trader Joe's. Now it is a seasonal item. So if you're interested, make sure you pick this up and grab this before it's gone. I love it. I use it every day, at least once a day, sometimes twice a day. I just love the way that it makes my skin feel, kind of rehydrates and rejuvenates my makeup and my skin for the day. My next two favorites and my last two favorites are actually from Tori Bell, but they're not lashes. Now you guys know I love, love, love their lashes so much. In fact, all of the lashes 
liners are in stock. So if you've been on the fence on whether or not you wanted to order some Tori Bell lashes, they have most of the kinds in stock. Everything from very natural to more dramatic. If you have any questions on maybe what lashes to choose for you, let me know. I'd be happy to help. But Tori Bell is called Tori Bell Cosmetics because they actually sell cosmetics. Now you guys know my love for Beauty Counter, but there are two cosmetics from Tori Bell that I have fallen in love with over the month and that are their lip glosses. Now you guys know how I feel about lip gloss. I love it, I love lip color, lipstick. In fact, the color I have on right now is from Tori Bell. This is the Vibrant Red Lip Color. I love these two. Now, if you're looking for a very neutral gloss, so something that's not gonna give you very much color, but it's just going to make your lips a little shiny so that you're not just have bare lip, this is the 14 karat gold gloss from Tori Bell. Now, in the tube itself, there are like little bits of gold. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it looks like there's little gold flakes in there. The wand, you can see that it's clear because there's no color on the wand. But when you put this gloss on, it just puts this really pretty natural shine on your lips. Now, I use this sometimes if I'm not wearing makeup or if I'm doing more of a heavy eye look and I don't want color on my lips, this works fan. Tactic. So I love this. I'll link this down below for you guys. I'll link the Tori Bell website. So if you're interested in lashes, you can grab those as well. And the other product from Tori Bell, and this is probably my favorite, even over the 24 karat gold, is this lip pumping gloss in blush. This is called Ignite. Now it's called Ignite for a reason. When you put this on, it's kind of this fiery, tingly feeling. It feels actually really nice on your lips, but the purpose of this is to not only give you this blushy, pink, shiny lip, but it's also a lip plumper. So that's where the Ignite and that little fiery feeling comes from. It gives your lips that added fullness without any type of cosmetic procedure. It's really, really amazing. So the gloss itself is kind of this really pretty, like blushy, pink and when you put it on it does tint your lips a very light neutral pink adds a little bit of gloss on there as well but the power of the plumping is amazing 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 this is something i will never not have i probably use this three or four times a week again when i'm wanting a neutral lip or when i'm wanting my lips to look a little fuller feel a little fuller this stuff is incredible so i'm going to put this down below for you as well Highly recommend this. The lashes, just anything Tori Bell is awesome. So the last two favorites I have for you are actually kitchen. Kitchen gadgets, kitchen related. First are the storage containers. And you guys saw me haul these in a grocery haul. I actually picked these up at Costco. There's a few sizes. They, it comes with one really large one like this. It comes with one pretty close to this size and two of these small ones. What is great about these containers is they are designed to both wash, rinse, and store your fruits and vegetables. So they do come apart. You can see the bottom comes off and that allows the water to drip into this tray. There's little ridges and openings on the bottom. There's little vents on the side that you can open and close depending on what you're storing. And on the lid, it basically tells you what to store in these containers. So you wash, rinse, store. Now, if it calls for no water, you would empty the little tray. If the water is checked, you would leave the water in the container and store it as is. These are awesome. I paid $24.99 for the four pack at Costco. This was just a couple of weeks ago. You can probably still score these at your local Costco and even look at Costco.com, but I love these. I use them all the time. I store my vegetables, my fruit, amazing. And the last kitchen gadget I want to share with you is something that I hesitated on getting. Now they reached out to me and offered to send this product to me and I kind of hemmed and hawed about it because I wasn't sure if I would like it, if it would be easy to use and I love it. I love it. My husband loves it. It's our go-to. We actually threw our other can openers in our camping gear because of the Kitchen Mama. Isn't this adorable? So this is the Kitchen Mama can opener. This is an electric can opener. You hit the button and it opens up your can. It'll automatically go backwards to release the lid for your can. So when your can is open, you hit the button and there's the reverse. It has a magnet, so it holds it onto your can. This thing is incredible. I'm so happy that they sent this to me. I told them that I was gonna use it for a while and if I liked it, I would share it. If I didn't like it, I would let them know and I would be happy to send it back. I love it. I seriously, seriously love this. You guys have 
to get this. It's easy for kids to use. If you have dexterity issues with your hands, it is so incredibly easy. It's husband easy. My husband struggled with my Pampered Chef one. He could never figure out how to use it, and he loves this. So I'm going to link this down below for you guys with a discount. It is not an affiliate link. It's simply a discount for you, but I'm going to link this down below. If you're looking for a new can opener, get the kitchen mama. And the last couple of favorites I want to share with you are YouTube channels. So these are a couple of new WW YouTube channels that I've recently discovered and I have been loving them, like literally binge watching them. The first one is Olivia Frida curves. She is a complete sweetheart. We've interacted a little bit. She's so nice. And she does a lot of like curvy mid-size try-on hauls, but she's also on the WW blue plan. And she shares a lot of what I eat in a days on WW. She has some great recipe ideas. She's just so calming and soothing and funny. And she's just a great resource for WW content and fashion content if you're looking for a little bit of both. So definitely check out Olivia, let her know that I sent you. And the other new WW YouTube channel, and I say new because she's fairly new to WW, she's actually a plus size influencer over on Instagram, but she just recently created her Weight Watchers channel and her name is Cortland. Johnson. She has the cutest family ever. She is so incredibly well-spoken. Not a lot of ums, uhs, uh. She's very, very well-spoken, which I love. Her content is on point. She's very, very good with her editing. She actually is a great resource for WW as well. And you can also follow her over on Instagram if you're looking for some plus size type of fashion inspiration, but she is very sweet. We've communicated as well. I love her channel. I actually binge watched all of her videos. She uploads once or twice a week, but I highly recommend if you're looking for some new Weight Watcher inspiration channels, then I highly recommend these two. You won't be sorry that you check them out and let them both know that I sent you over and that you heard about them here on this favorites video. All right, my friends, that is it for this month's favorites. I hope you enjoyed seeing my food favorites, beauty, couple of kitchen gadgets, and sharing a couple of my new favorite WW YouTube channels. I will be putting out another video next month with some more favorites. It's a great way to get inspiration, ideas, to find some new exciting products, new channels, so I love filming these videos for you guys and you guys seem to really like having these new ideas. I will link everything that I talked about in today's video down below. Of course, leave any comments if you have any questions or suggestions or products that you found that you think I should try out that may make July's favorites. If you're new, I'd love for you to stick around. Just hit that little subscribe button and the little red bell so you're notified when new videos are uploaded. I do upload pretty much six to seven days a week, so you don't wanna miss any content. Give this video a big thumbs up if you love favorites, and of course, leave your comments down below. I love hearing from you guys. Thank you so much for spending some time with me today, and I'll see you all next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>